Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about some new set photos, some new leaks. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment, and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. So this video we're going to be talking about the leaks for episode 18 of season 6, and also we're going to be talking about the trailer for the new episode coming this week. This is the Grodd episode. So basically what's going on with this video, why it might sound a bit off, is I actually recorded this Godspeed video a few days ago, but just due to the fact that The Flash came on, there was bigger Supergirl news to talk about in regards to mon and stuff like that, this video's been postponed, and considering this new trailer does have some stuff to say, but I feel like it would be better if I joined these two videos together, so that's why once we get past this Flash trailer stuff, it's going to probably sound a bit different because it was me recording a few days ago. But anyway, so let's go ahead and talk about the trailer and then we'll go on to the Godspeed part of the video in a minute. So what happens in the trailer? We're not going to necessarily break it down shot by shot. It's a lot of very fast rapid shots. The episode is titled Grodd Friended Me, so Grodd's obviously coming back. And I'm going to point out the most interesting things. So Barry's in the forest, where obviously Grodd does appear a couple of times in the past. I feel like they always go to that forest. Barry puts on this sort of dampener, you know, the thing they always put in their ears when Grodd is around. The camera zooms back, they do a dolly zoom to obviously emphasize the effect of Grodd taking over Barry, essentially. And also in one of the shots, Barry is in a sort of jail cell, a prison cell. And it seems like maybe Caitlyn is actually outside, so Caitlyn is on the side of Grodd. And I think it's because she's trying to be nice and trying to, you know, work with him. And so we get some other shots of Barry outside. He's in a Slash costume. I think we're going to get some more Flash stuff this episode. We haven't had that much recently. And we go to the most interesting shot of the trailer, which is of Harrison Wells. So I think this is where we go back to the Harrison Wells sort of stuff that we had previously last episode. But it does seem like maybe this is actual Harry. Like Harry survived, he's with Grodd, and maybe they both survived in their own way. So I don't know what's happening, but I feel like he's real because he's actually talking to Barry. So what happens if Harry has survived? And basically the way this trailer ends is you get the revelation, Grodd is here. Grodd is the reason for all of this, and Grodd wants to kill Barry. Is he going to kill Barry? Obviously, there's a chance, but, you know, in the end, he's not going to kill Barry. So, is Harrison Wells coming back? Is Harry from Earth 2 actually him? Or is it just, like, in his mind? Is it a different version of Harry? It's definitely not Nash. So, I feel like it is Harry. So, yeah. Theorize about that in the comments down below. And theorize, do you think Barry's going to die or not? And anyway, let's go ahead and get to that Godspeed part of the video right now. So this is sort of heading towards the end of the season. Obviously, still got like five episodes or so. I reckon they're doing 22 episodes. I can't confirm that right now. If you guys know, let me know. But they're on episode 18 right now and they're shooting it. I don't know the title for this episode, but we know some stuff that is happening due to some set photos yesterday. And these set photos are very spoilery and obviously there's a lot to talk about and I'm very excited about this. But before we get into this video, please be sure to spread the channel around, share this video around on Twitter, on Instagram and whatever you use. Or in real life to people who watch The Flash. Because we are 100 subscribers away from 100,000 subscribers. It would be amazing if you guys could do that because it's a big goal and I really really want to reach it and it's obviously getting there. It's hard, but I think we can do it if you guys, you know, can help a bit. So, yeah, please be sure to do that and make sure to come watch these videos every day. I know that I was a bit inactive recently, you know, the last couple of weeks or so, but I'm back uploading videos every day, so don't miss any of them. Okay, so you can go back and watch some of those past videos if you have missed them, but today we're going to be talking about the spoilers for episode 18 of season 6. So, yeah, without further ado, most of the stuff in today's video is going to be from Canada Graphs, so go check out his blog post, it'll be in the link in the description below. There is a lot more photos, I'm using about 6 photos or so, we're going to talk about them, we're going to talk about the stuff that's on the blog, obviously there is more there, because he's got a lot of information regarding the shoot that they were doing, 
and you know the scenes and stuff like that and so yeah i highly recommend go check out his blog it's in the description down below and also follow him on twitter to be regularly updated about this stuff so yeah let's go ahead and get into this so we're going to be reading from the blog and we will obviously go over the photos just after and i'm sure the photos will correlate and they'll be played throughout this video as well but i'll get to those in a minute so the flash was on location for episode 18 of the sixth season in downtown Vancouver yesterday, around the same space where they filmed the final battle for blood work at the end of the first half of season 6. Last night they started a scene being done that included a couple of stunt scenes for us with Grant Gustin and his stunt double as the Flash fighting obviously against Godspeed. So that is the massive spoiler, we'll get to Godspeed in a sec. And so he says, yes you heard that right, there were a couple of scenes, first one where they dropped a stuntman in the Godspeed outfit from several floors up into a vehicle and then the Flash got thrown into a van just after that, they did another scene and there was a scene where Godspeed seems to be looking down at the Flash on the ground and he might be kneeling down towards him when the Flash zips out of there so there's going to be a lot of questions regarding this however Godspeed was not the only returnee that night after Godspeed's first set of scenes he left and someone he wasn't able to confirm if it was the same person, but they came in dressed in a cloak with gauntlets and a green glow. Does that sound familiar? Pipe Piper seems to be back. Oh, and he's helping the Flash. So the pair did some scenes where they appear to be fighting Godspeed. As they both look up, at one point you hear someone yell out for the Flash. And a bit later they did a scene where they slowly encroached on this vehicle that Godspeed fell on. And they get closer and Godspeed is lying flat on the top of a crumpled vehicle. After that scene they moved down the street. It was pouring with rain. Apparently the weather conditions were very very bad. And the scene seemed to be with Godspeed grabbing a random person. While others run around in panic. There also seems to be a guy standing beside him in the scene in a beige jacket wearing what appears to be sunglasses which would be a bit odd because it's in the middle of the night when they were filming this and so he was not sure if it was a random guy or just like a crew member and so yeah that's all the details on the blog as of right now and so let's scroll back up and we're gonna be breaking down some of this stuff so they started the night by filming a stunt scene they did a couple of those Grant was there but also a stunt double was there and this was against Godspeed so yeah freak out guys Godspeed is back I don't know if he's gonna be the main villain or not we're going to be theorizing a bit about that in today's video, but, you know, the big thing, he's back, why is he back, you know, what's the reason, obviously we saw him at the start of this season, and we sort of theorized due to the way they ended that Godspeed stuff in episode 1, with there being, like, multiple clones of Godspeed that they've been taken down over the summer, and then we had this weird Godspeed that screamed and sort of, like, was this kind of robotic type Godspeed. So we theorized he would be returning, and as soon as we found out that this black hole stuff was coming, because in the comics Godspeed is actually linked and sort of around the same time as they're doing the black hole stuff in Rebirth, that maybe that would be a way to bring back Godspeed due to the cliffhanger in episode 1 of this season. So yeah, Godspeed is back, I'm super excited for that. I really hope he is the villain for the back half of the season. It's episode 18, I think there is a chance that he could go on to be that villain for the back half. Obviously we need someone else, and I think a speedster is very fitting because we haven't had a speedster villain in a very long time. So I would be completely down for this, I think it's very possible. However, it could also be just in a one episode appearance like he's done twice already, which is a bit annoying, it does kind of piss me off a bit because I think he's a good villain and he doesn't get the time of the day to properly shine. And I think this could be his chance. But anyway, so there was a couple of scenes that they did. They did one when they dropped Godspeed onto a car. And so this was actually, I guess, the Flash fighting Godspeed. They're fighting on, like, the walls. You know, that would be CGI'd in. And then he gets thrown down. And at a point, apparently the Flash gets thrown into a van. But, you know, Godspeed gets thrown into a van as well. It seems like Godspeed's always getting, like, thrown into something, if I remember rightly. But, so, yeah, there's gonna be a big fight between The Flash and Godspeed. They film multiple scenes. I don't know if he's in this whole episode or not, but, you know, it seems like they did a kind of big chunk of it. And so, Godspeed was obviously doing a bunch of these scenes with just The Flash. But then, 
we got another returning character who's confirmed, Pied Piper, who we haven't seen in freaking ages. I don't remember the last time that we saw him, but he is back and he's helping the Flash. He's on the good side, obviously, how he left. And yeah, so that's just a really big surprise because we haven't seen him in so long, quite frankly. Like, I forgot about him and I think most of you guys probably forgot about him. And so he's going to be helping the Flash fight Godspeed. So they did multiple scenes against Godspeed when they're fighting together. He's obviously got his green glowing gauntlet and he's dressed in his cloak. Looks very cool and so it seems like they're going to be fighting together. So whatever the reason Pipe Piper has to show up, I'm guessing it's pretty big. Because he hasn't shown up for these other things before, like since he left. So yeah, it seems like, you know, it could be Godspeed's going on a rampage. Maybe he is the villain of the back half. We don't know, but let's say he is you know, Pipe Piper comes back to try and help out. So anyway, let's go on to talk about will he be the main villain. I think there is a really high possibility due to the fact that this is episode 18, we'll have about four more episodes, maybe five episodes, and he could appear before this because remember they don't always film all the stuff outside, could be done on the green screen, inside, or you know, they're just shooting inside shots for other episodes, and he was maybe teased just before, you know, heading into episode 18 or something like that. So I think there is a really high chance that he could be the main villain of the back half because he is like such a fan favorite. He's a big character, he's a speedster. I think, you know, he is primed and ready to be the villain of the back half, but I don't know how likely it is because of what they've done to him in the past. He was in episode 18 last season, he was in episode one, and he was really a kind of nothing character. And they did introduce in episode 1 the concept that there is all these different versions of Godspeeds out there. So I would be really interested in seeing, you know, this version of Godspeed, someone completely different to the August Heart that we saw at the end of last season. But anyway, let's move on to talk about the photos. So we've got a bunch of photos from Canada Graphs again, go check out the blog. But the first photo I have got here is of Godspeed. It's just like a good look at him, he's face on. And you can see his suit, his suit's pretty much exactly the same, I can't tell any difference. But yeah, so really cool seeing him again in these photos. I definitely got really hyped and I'm very hyped still right now. This is a photo of Godspeed and the bystander that we talked about, like a random person. He's grabbing like by the throat or by the neck. And so he's obviously going to be causing some chaos. I like this photo here, yeah it's a bit blurry but you get to see both of them in frame. Godspeed and the Flash standing next to each other, obviously between takes. So then we move on, we've got this photo, this is of Pied Piper and Barry. You can see him in his hood and Barry's there just in his suit. It's a bit blurry, but that's no problem. And you see Godspeed as he's on this crumpled car. You see the gauntlets of Pied Piper and yeah, it's just very cool stuff right here. So. That's about it for today's video guys, thank you guys so much for watching, are you excited to see the return of Godspeed? I know I am, so please be sure to share the video around to all your friends, that would be highly appreciated. But anyway guys, I'll see you guys later, goodbye. I see red.